Yo, what is up, YouTube? I saw back here again, and today we'll be doing a uh, updated sneaker collection. I haven't done a sneaker video in quite a while, actually. So, uh, we'll be doing an updated sneaker collection. Last one was October 16th, 2021. Um, and today is May 20. Twenty fifth, I think, May twenty fifth, twenty twenty two. I will be doing from least favorite to most favorite or to favorite. In the old video, I had fourteen pairs. Now I have twenty three pairs, so I have quite a lot more. So let's jump right into it. It's not like third time shooting this video. This is not like the way my hair keeps coming out in the video. So third time. Uh, third time is the charm, so let's get straight to it. First shoe, the UNLV Dunks. I got these in January of 2021, right before that all the dunk hype. I got them. Uh, I didn't wear them for like three months because I wanted to sell them, and the price never went up. And then I put them on feet, and the price went up. And so yeah, um, I put these on trade block. I'll put my trade block in the bio. If you you want like trade anything for these, uh, they're size twelve, and I realized that I am not a size twelve. I'm a size ten and a half. So yeah, if you haven't think ten and a half, eleven, eleven and a half, even trade me. Put those there. Next shoe we got is the Georgetown. Which I bought these. These are also size twelve, but these fit me better than those uh, Georgetown. Which I bought them for three ten in San Antonio. Oh, I bought the UNLV Dunks for 240. I bought these for 310 in San Antonio at True North. Um, not much to say about these, really. I really liked them when they first came out. I bought them when they first came out, like the release date. And I liked how they looked, I liked how they came out. Love the, I don't know, I just love threes for some reason. Well, like, yeah, I feel like threes are my third favorite model probably but i love threes next on the list is my muslins i traded my white oreos for these my fours and regretted a lot the price went up drastically and these are sitting at the same price like but i still love these shoes i could put on some good fits with these shoes too and the white oreos i look kind of poopoo in but these uh, mm -hmm, these are real deal i love these shoes this is not like the canvas because it gets so dirty, but it's easy to clean, but except for the suede. Uh, but other than that, love these shoes. Mm, next shoe. My Doc Martens. Uh, they still smell like Badissi, like the last video. But the Doc Martens, if you want alt girls, emo girls, cat girls, fanboys, whatever. Put these on, they'll come running for you. Girls love a dude in Doc Martens. And if you listen to Steve Lacey especially and have some vintage Carhartt, they love you even more. Uh, put some khakis and a jacket or hoodie and you got yourself a fit. Real easy to match. I want the Supreme ones with the webs uh, or the uh, Ralph Simmons with little metal part. It was just so dope. Love you. Uh, next one, next shoe. My mono ice easies. I get a lot of compliments on these. My friends don't like these, but I love them. Uh, I love the translucent. You can see my little toes when I go sockless. Uh, I like wiggling around my toes in these. Nice fresh air. Uh, these shoes are just so comfy. I wear them to my new job at Parks and Rec. They're so comfy. Um, I can't hoop in them because I don't know why, but they hurt my feet when they hoop in them. But I can run in them and or like speed walking them and stuff. But Yeezys are are some of my favorites. I love Yeezy. Love you, Yeezy. Next shoe. 
Talking about dunks, the reason they're so low is because they're a size 12 and my toes like right here. So size 12 is like two sizes bigger than my size. So rip, rip me. Uh, I don't know why it smells so bad. I've only worn them once and my toes like right here. I have to triple sock whenever I wear these. I would wear them more. I love the materials on them. I love them a lot. I bought them for 200. Now they go for like 300. I love these shoes. Shout out on iPad 6 High Beach for hooking it up. Uh, I bought them at Sneaker Fest in October for 200. And yeah. Oh, on the, on the Yeezys, I bought them for 460, bruh. Low key. The place I work at now, Status, they finessed me, sold them to me for 460. I was, I was just too hungry and I bought them. I didn't even look at StockX prices or nothing. I just bought them. Anyways, next shoe, next shoe, next shoe, next shoe. Um, let's see, make way, make way, make way. Ugh. Next shoe is my, I'm um, probably my Air Vapor Max Plus. I love the shoe my dad got for me for Christmas, so I appreciate that. Um, I. I would wear a shoe more since I'm afraid of freaking breaking my whole leg and tearing my ACL and then I'll get it amputated after. But other than that, uh, other than that danger hazard, uh, I love a shoe. I'm just scared of freaking losing my left leg. But besides that, I love a shoe. Next shoe, my easy 450s, I love a shoe with all my heart. Um, it's like a bone thingy, and yeah, I never have to tie them. I always just keep them tied, slip them on. It's just like a condom. Um, they're so weird, but they're so cool. With some warm ups and just a regular T-shirt, that's a fit, easy fit with these. Next, my neutral gray eighty fives. I love these shoes. It says they don't get any love from me personally. I just love the silhouette, the color, the neutral colors. The only reason I don't wear these is because I have a fat foot. No, I have a fat leg. Not fat leg, but like I have a big leg. And I don't, I don't think like these thin shoes look good on my big leg. So I don't really wear them that much. Only with cargos, but. I don't know. So I'm giving them the love they deserve. I might put them on trade block. So if you're interested, size 11 and a half on trade block. I'll put the thing in my bio. Mm, next shoe, next shoe, next shoe. My Mason Mahars. I love them with all my heart. Uh, handcrafted clay on the bottom. Jap Japanese. Uh, Yashihiros. Uh, if you know, you know. Um, the Petersons. I want some high tops. Either all black or this color. These are so sexy. I get a lot of compliments from people when I wear these. They think they're so cool. My parents unfortunately don't, uh, but I love them. Shout out Mason Mahara. Next shoe, oh, Loki. This is in, in back of the freaking neutral grays and the Maharas. I got these. I traded my 7210s. I spent 205 on the 7210s because that's retail plus tax. I got them in store at Hibbit. And then uh, plus 20 on trade block. So it's two, like 222 uh, for these shoes. Um, conversation Among Us. You don't know, you know Joe Freshgood. Joe Freshgood's. Uh, collab with New Balance 2002 R's. I love the silhouette. This is, I don't know about the colors. Uh, I haven't even put them on yet. So, I don't know. I'm kind of neutral about these. Anyways, next shoe we got. My Stussy Forces. I don't really like Forces that much. Uh, I appreciate forces, but uh, for me, I don't really rock forces like that. But my Stussies, I love my Stussies. I, I traded my pandas for these. My pandas were a 12 and a half, and I'm a 10 and a half. So just imagine that. 
traded my friend he bought these for me at sneaker con i was like you buy me a shoe and buy me some other stuff and i'll give you my pandas and that's when pandas were at like four five hundred and so he bought me some stuff and i gave him my pandas for these a jacket and that's literally all these and a j jacket a 15 dollar jacket but the 15 dollar jacket i've gotten offers like 60 60 bucks so shout out nate my next shoe <laughs> my bad bunnies i love my bad bunnies oh my god they're so versatile comfy stylish jeans cargos shorts whatever i look good in shorts with these i love wearing shorts with these take them to the beach take them everywhere they're basically my beaters well not really well uh basically my beaters uh this is lovely's Shout out Bad Bunny. Uh, if y'all don't know, me and Bad Bunny are actually cousins. So, uh, ladies, hit me up if you want Bad Bunny tickets. If you don't, then uh, stay, stay, stay in L. Uh, be an L girl. But anyways, next shoe. My international spear dons. They released like, I don't know. I don't remember when I got them. But I got them for like 160 for retail. And my mom didn't like them, but I love them. Uh, I've only seen one other person with them, so I'm, yeah. I saw them at the mall, like, oh shit, I have, I was like, oh snap, I have those shoes. And yeah, but I love these shoes. Um, just the iridescent, everything. I'm gonna take a picture in the flash, you know what I'm saying? All the countries, Japan, freaking Japan. Freaking America, Germany, Norway, Turkey, Brazil, Argentina, France, French, Italy, Portugal, Denmark, Norway, whatever this is. All right, next shoe. My foam runners. Foam runners, essential. Essential, essential warm ups, foam runners, and a hoodie. I wear my foam runners to work, to freaking walk, to freaking do literally everything. I love my foam runners with all my heart. They're like Yeezy slides, just with the back, so I can wear them to work. So shout out Yeezy, I love Yeezy. Uh, uh, not much to say about these, just. Oh, I got these for three sixty. Now they go up to wards, up wards to five, five sixty, six hundred. I love them. Next shoe. Oof. My Alma Minier, my Alma Minier threes. I love my Alma Minier threes. I could literally make love with them right now, but I won't because the camera's filming. But. Uh, I got these for five nineteen on Goat Used, and they were only used once, and I've only worn them like five times. I only wear them on like special occasions or when I'm trying to flex a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, cause they did win a sneaker of the year. So once I bought them, they went as soon as I bought them, like a month later, they went up to like. Now because I bought these in October, and then they were like I got them for five nineteen. And then a couple months later, it went up. In December, it went up to like 900. And I was freaking wet from that. So, yeah. I love my alma mirrors. Even though I don't want them that much. They need, they need more love. They need, need more love, most definitely. Next shoe. My Vivian Westwood A6, what do you know about Vivian Westwood? Literally nothing. You don't know anything about Vivian Westwood. I could slip these on just like a condom. Uh, I love them so much. So easy to wear. So versatile. Like my bad bunnies, they're, they're so versatile. Cargos, pants, literally whatever I want in these. Um, uh, the netting. I love the netting. A lot of people don't, but I love the netting. Uh, I want to get the black pair too, just to have a set. Uh, and A6, low key A6 is where it's at, bro. But then see, I'm just copying A6, so get on the A6 train right now before prices go up. 
Next shoe. One of my favorite shoes in my collection. Well, a favorite shoe in my collection. 2002R Protection Pack Sea Salt colorway. The shoe is literally heaven on earth. I wear these all the time. These and the Vivian Westwoods, I wear them all the time. Uh, cargoes, pants. Nah, I don't wear pants. I don't wear jeans with these because I feel like it's going to stay blue. So I don't wear jeans with these. Only cargoes and shorts and stuff and warm ups. But besides that, I love your shoes. If I could make little 2002 R babies with these, I would uh, make little New Balance babies with these. But unfortunately, I can't. So I'll find out a way to do it though. Definitely will. All right, next three pairs. I got them all this month and I got them for steals. So what you bought it here is 100% legit. Um, and they're some of my favorite pairs. I've been wanting some some of these pairs for quite a while. And I'm just super excited that I got them. All right. They're not in any order. So they're all my favorite. Boom. Let me do it again. Boom. Jordan 7 French Blues. These are so sexy. I saw Paul Souls get them. And I was, I was like, oh, snap. I need to get these. I want more 7s in my collection. The Citrus 7s, Cardinal 7s. I want freaking... I want more 8s in my collection. I want the 3P 8s. The Bugs Bunny. The freaking Raptor. I want the Raptor 7s too. But they're so clean. I got them for 70 bucks. Do you believe that? You don't believe that. But I got them for 70 bucks from my boy John. Shout out John. I'm gonna give you a little surprise, John. Uh, I ain't talking about shoes and money, but uh, I'll give you a little surprise, John. Next shoe. Recently a shoe came out and it was inspired by this shoe. The shoe's called the Military Blacks and inspired by this shoe. 2012 Military Blues, oh my God. And guess how much I got them for? Yeah, you didn't guess right. 150. I got them for 150. Look at that. No star loss whatsoever. Uh, no heel drag. Oh my god, these are so sexy. I got them for 150. It says no box. Uh, I'm the one who creased them. So, besides this, everything was freaking. Oh my god. John deserves some special loving. If I could have little sex with these i would um these shoes are so sexy um we need a thumbnail is my hair okay because i'm trying to shoot another video so if my hair isn't okay and this is the last video i'm shooting all right but these shoes are so sexy i've been wanting these forever um I don't think I'm gonna get the military blacks because there's just, I don't know, the same thing as these is black. But, and I need to shave some money. I literally have poo poo money right now in my savings. Because this month of May, I've been buying, buying, buying. But now. It's time for the moment you've been waiting for. Duh. Y'all know what these are? I, don't, I didn't think so. These are Fear Pack 4s. Oh my god, these are so sexy. The suede is so buttery. I literally got them today. John dropped them off at, at work. And uh, I paid him. Guess how much? Guess. Not 900. Not 600. Not 500. Not 400. Not 300. Not 200. 150 for these, bro. I said boy. Bro, that's so cringy. 150, look at them. Uh, poop, where's my brush? Well, I paid 150 for them. Uh, and 
The suede is just so sexy. The shoe is just so sexy. The colors are just so sexy. Literally everything about the shoe is so sexy. In my last video, you can see that I've been wanting these and my French blue fours, my French blue sevens for whenever I posted the, the top 10 shoes I still need. I put those in there. I just want like John's uncle's feet. Ah, oh, John's uncle's feet. It smells so good. Oh, just kidding, I cleaned the insides too. Or did I? But anyways, these shoes are a little masterpiece for me. Uh, they'll probably be worn tomorrow. I haven't even tried them on yet, but they'll probably be worn tomorrow to work. It's just to flex on my coworkers. And yeah, that's probably it for the video today, guys. Uh, I'm running out of iPhone storage, so... Uh, that's literally it for the video. I uh, hope you all enjoyed this uh, update for y'all. I'll probably edit it today or tomorrow and post it as soon as I can. So uh, let me know what else y'all want to see in the comments below. You can DM me on Instagram. It's going to be right here. Or actually, it might be right here. I don't know. We'll see it when it pops up. But anyways, I'm probably going to edit this. Stay up in a couple hours and then go to sleep. But later.